the state of India's hijab prohibition in schools has been upheld by a court in India. On Tuesday, an Indian court upheld a ban on the hijab in schools in the southern state of Karnataka AA, a decision that might establish a precedent for the rest of the nation, which has a large Muslim population. The state's prohibition last month provoked demonstrations from Muslim students and parents, as well as counter-protests from Hindu pupils. The prohibition is being criticized as another and other means of marginalizing a population that makes up around 13% of India's 1.35 billion inhabitants. In the ruling, Chief Justice Ritu Rajawasti of the High Court of Karnataka said, We are of the considered judgment that the wearing of hijab by Muslim women does not constitute a component of vital religious practice in the Islamic religion. He dismissed multiple petitions contesting Karnataka's prohibition, claiming that the government has the authority to establish standard norms. We are of the considered conclusion that requiring kids to wear a school uniform is just a reasonable and legally permitted limitation to which the students cannot object, Awasti added. Aisha Imtiars, a third-year undergraduate student in Utopi, Karnataka AA, where the demonstrations started, said she would either drop out of her government-funded institution or enroll in a correspondence course. Her Muslim female classmates, she added, were preparing to do the same. We can't, and we won't, take off the hijab, she said. Exams for the fifth semester will be held next month. Unless things change before then, we'll have to sit that one out. To avoid possible unrest, Karnataka officials ordered the closure of schools and colleges, as well as limitations on public gatherings in various areas of the state, ahead of the ruling. Amit Shah, the federal home minister, stated last month that he prefers pupils to wear school uniforms rather of religious garb. Currently, there is no national legislation or regulation governing school uniforms, but the Karnataka decision may push other states to do so. The Students Islamic Organization of India, which represents thousands of Muslim students throughout India, expressed concern that Tuesday's ruling will lead additional states to outlaw the hijab in the classroom. We don't want it to become a national precedent, and we want it reversed, said Musab Karzi, the party's national secretary. The court's decision may encourage additional states to outlaw it. As a result, we will very certainly go to the Supreme Court. Karnataka is the only southern state managed by Prime Minister Narendra Modi's Hindu nationalist party Ajanta Party, BJP, and state assembly elections are scheduled for next year. Critics claim that the BJP is profiting from the divide between Hindus and Muslims, despite the fact that the party claims the hijab ban has nothing to do with its political objectives.